I don't know if Rudolph is on who holds the spell, eh? but with this cold, this thing is pretty warm, but my hands ain't. And um, Merry Christmas, guys. Um, we are done with 2021. Yay! And um, Omarion is going to, you know, take a break tomorrow. Today's the 24th of, um, I don't know how Sana does his thing, but with a whole beard, my God. This thing is soft. I think I should grow out my beard. Yeah, so, yes. Um, <laughs> um, hi, how y'all doing? Um, it has been a while, I know. But um, here we are. Um, I'm excited for today. And I hope you're not on the naughty list. But because we have all been good this year, we have all been trying, and you deserve a break. We all deserve a break, and this is why I prepared something special. Um, in America, we have eggnog, but in Uganda, we have obusida, and um, yeah, Ugandan Santas have obusida. Hooray! Yay! Let me go in before I get hypothermia. <laughs> Enjoy my episode. Hola, hey, so, um, this is Numa Bushera. It's a pure millet flower. Um, Bushera is millet. So, um, grab your saucepan. This is the brand we're using. Um, this is a brand new pack and after you open it please put this in a plastic container um which has no opening because if you leave it out in this in this um paper bag you're going to find um those flower mites so, yeah so three tablespoons of your millet flour obviously it's millet and um yeah store it very well in a cool dry place these are things that you you, you you'll be knowing <laughs> um we're going to use 1000 ml of water so um first um for three for three um for three tablespoons so you stir with a wooden spatula because you're going to be doing a lot of stirring you know, you don't, you know, you're using a metallic specular and you know what happens when metal glides with metal. So you stir until the chimere mere gets out. That cold. <laughs> anyway, so you stir until the, um, let me first Google. The kagambo is lumps. <laughs> so you stir so that, um, the lumps dissolve, you know, um, some people um, stir it with cold water, then um, they put hot water directly. But um, this is how I grew up making it. Yeah. So you stir it, Bulunji. You stir it very well as you're adding your water. We're going to use two, 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 two cups of two mason jars and of water. So you, you heat up your fire. <laughs> so you turn on your fire and um you continue stirring you know this is one thing that needs um a little more tension because lamps just like in the first 10 minutes of its cooking lamps just come from it just they just be there you know so um this is my second jar of water and 
I continue starring. Leave no flower uncooked. Man, this came from far. Yeah, so leave no flower uncooked. And, um, well, anyway. I hope your December is Decembering like mine. Um, this has been one happier, um, best year of my life, I can say. You know, best year in my 30s yet. And, um, yeah, you know, I'm thankful for, for life, for good health, for, for friends that communicate, for friends that understand me. And yeah. Anyway, this is the Basara starring situation. I mean, this is minute eight. Continue starring your situation. Um. Yeah. Um. People actually cook it. Um. To those that do not like it with milk. Um. They continue stirring it from here, and um, you see, it thickens really fast. And you, you, you see with the level of, um, of effort I'm putting to stir this basilla, you can even still see lumps coming. So, um, I believe the first, the first, the first few minutes really, 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 really count, and for 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 a good final product this is like minute 15 and um yeah so um i did put a little cow milk because that's the test that i remember it with before i became lactose intolerant this ha this is lactose free but still i don't I don't drink it with lactose. And um, then I put almond milk. <laughs> Let me tell you one. Yo, don't be judgmental here. This is a safe space. Let me be. Leave me alone. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, as you can see, you, the magic is yet to happen. The magic is happening. So, yeah. I know you'll be like, oh my God, you're putting in a lot of work. But the final product is amazing. So um, you let it simmer for like another 15 minutes. Um, let it simmer. Let it simmer. Yeah. And... Um, so that it doesn't burn because it burns quickly that too <clears throat> so doo, 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 doo. look at that heavenly um, so I let it cool down for a few minutes Look at me. I don't want to make a waste of food. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, yeah. That angle wasn't working, so I decided to... Um, oh, yeah. Grab your cup. I could pour it, but then... Um, pouring it from a saucepan into... A cup would have been messier. So I decided to use this um, this technique. Uh, my sweetener today is honey. Black Santa loves honey. <laughs> yeah. Na 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 na. Ta da. And do a little more starring. <laughs> oh my yes. And that is our finished product, ladies and gentlemen. 
Black Santa has taken a break from the aesthetic of the beard. But um, today, let's... I've had this before, but... Um, this feels like Christmas best invention ever. You know, this is like tapping into another dimension. Vibranium. I don't know if you can put alcohol because with eggnog you can put alcohol but because of thing something I have not tried but I don't drink alcohol anymore apart from now special alright guys please like share and follow and um Please try this at home. If you have any, try it. So, you know, if someone has been cooking it for you, try to cook it for yourself. And um, please stay warm. Wear your mask. And sanitize. Merry Christmas.